Welcome to our demo. In this demo, we're going to use Btool to investigate global configuration values, investigate configuration values in a single app, learn the source of configuration values, and then check for typos in stanza and setting names. First, notice what directory I'm in. I'm in opt splunk bin. Remember these are where the binaries are, where we can run commands. So the first thing we're going to do is use btool to investigate global configuration values. And we're going to use this command here. And whatever configuration file prefix we want to use, and for this I'll just use transforms, and then list. Now it's showing us all of our global values. The next thing we want to do is investigate configuration values in one single app. And in our instance of Splunk, we don't have very many apps installed, but remember, searching and reporting is considered an app. So we'll do it in the context of searching and reporting. So we're going to do a similar command as last time. This time we'll use the flag app equals search. And again, let's look at transforms and list. So these are the current active stanzas that Splunk is using for the search app in the transforms comp files. Now while we're doing this, let's also learn where configuration values are coming from. So we can do a similar command, and I'm just going to push the up arrow on my Linux environment. It'll work for Linux or Mac and probably Windows. I'm just going to remove this app flag and then put a debug flag after it. So these are where all the transforms.conf files are that the Splunk search app is using. And they also show the values. So these are where all these values are coming from. The final thing we want to do with Btool is check for typos in stanza and setting names. And this is pretty simple. We do a similar command and simply the keyword check. And there are no typos. We covered some dense content in this section. We learned about configuration or comp files. They govern almost every aspect of Splunk. Changes you make in the GUI or Splunk web edits the comp files behind the scenes. You can also edit the comp files directly. We discussed comp file precedents. Remember, don't touch the default folder, no matter what context you're in. And then we use Btool to verify conf file stands of values that are currently being used. So now you should be comfortable with discussing and understanding what conf files do, doing basic edits to conf files, and using Btool to verify configurations.